That is our taking tiger to the mountain. So taking tiger to the mountain as an exercise all on its own, let's take it out of the set for a moment, is a really, really good hip mobility and leg strength exercise without a doubt. Um, there's also a lot of opening and, and closing and opening in the arms. So there's a lot going on in take tiger to the mountain to help with the, with the hip strength and, and mobility. There's also a lot of throwing and interesting stuff in it as well. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna lunge into one leg and we're gonna cross our arms by kind of closing the chest. We're gonna raise those hands up over the head and we're gonna shift our weight to the opposite leg and we're gonna press our hands out. And this is a bit of a tricky pose. You've gotta really rotate through your, your hip and you're pressing out and away. Then we're gonna come back through center so both legs are bent. And then as we straighten the one leg, and we gotta keep our lower abdominal engaged, keep our lower back settled. We're gonna cross through. We're gonna pick up. We're gonna push across and settle. We're gonna roll through, cross, lift up, press open and settle so those arms come together we're keeping and i really have to focus on keeping that lower abdominal engaged so that i don't kick out my tailbone through let's go one more circuit in this direction so we'll go over and down now let's try it the other way so we're going to cross the arms on the opposite leg and then we open up so one arm's traveling a long distance, it's traveling along with the lunge, and the other arm's just kind of pressing out. Then we settle, they gather through the middle, lift and push open. So again, a lot of work in here on building both leg strength, but also hip mobility. We've got to kind of stretch and open the hip We've got to engage in that lower abdominal and we're getting that turning, coiling kind of motions as we, as we come through and pick up. I'm just gonna do a couple with my back turn because sometimes it's easier to follow that way. So let's do a couple to the left side. So we'll lunge into our left leg, lift up, press across to our right leg, we'll settle through the right leg and come through. Now, the more workout you're looking for, the more you can slide these legs apart. And there's almost a dip as we dip through the middle to really work on those legs. Let's try that with the other, starting on the other side. So we'll cross our arms on the right side, come up and over and settle, come through, come up and open and settle, come through. One more time, come up, open that up and come through and we'll walk in those legs. Doesn't take a lot of repetitions of those to work the legs over. 